He lives! Set me down. Uh, uh, it's red. My God protected me, sire. But how, Daniel? Over me through the night. And again, for having an unyielding faith in him, this must be acknowledged. Bring them in. Yes, sire. No, it can't be. That's. Impossible! I beg of you, sire. I've served you for many years. It's too late for pleas. You sealed your fate. Bring him forward. Stand up. You were two of my most trusted administrators. You were so jealous of Daniel, you committed treachery. I have no choice but to sentence you to the lion's den. No! No! Take them away. No, please! Please, anything but this! No! Please! Daniel, the scroll. Daniel survived the lion's den because his God, the living God, rewarded Daniel's faith. So today, I have prepared a decree for all the land to follow. Darius decreed that all of his kingdom would give thanks to the God of Daniel's people. Darius' scheming administrators were taken to the lion's den. Daniel never did return to Jerusalem, but he lived out his days as a trusted administrator to Darius the Mede and then Cyrus of Persia. And yes, he remained forever loyal to the laws of Moses.